So here I have created the DB logic class, which is a normal Java class. Took out a few constants like the database name. Here I have named it as names.db. The versioning, since this is my very first version of the database, I have versioned it at one. Then the table name. What is the table name of the database? I have said it is TB underscore names. As I told you, I have to have a SQLite open helper. So I have created an inner class here, which is the SQLite open helper class. And this extends the SQLite open helper. So whenever I'll be extending the SQLite open helper, what I'll be getting is, I'll be getting an on create and I'll be getting an on upgrade. So in the on create, what I'm doing is I'm executing a SQL query here, which says create table with the table name and the table name is names.db, all right? TB underscore name, sorry. Then I'm doing it an identifier, I'm giving it an ID, which is of the type integer and this is the primary key here and this primary key will be auto incrementing that is as many the number of items it will be keep on incrementing itself then I'm doing, doing a name of name field here which is text and it should not be null similarly numbers and it should not be null and here on the on, on upgrade I'm actually dropping the table if it exists exists that is it is already present and I'll just call the on create again All right so this is what I'm doing here then what I have done is I have created various methods here. Here I have created a SQLite open helper object here on the top and I'm actually creating a new SQLite open helper with the context here. So the context SQL is the context that I'm using here and I just open up this context SQL that is the SQLite open helper dot object for actually performing some write operations onto the database. All right. I have created a method here, close, which will be actually closing up the database connection here. Very much like opening and closing connections that I'm creating here. Then I have few methods here, which is insert, update, delete, and the get string. So let's talk about the insert method here. So in the insert method, what I'm doing is I'm having the insert method used on the SQLite open helper object which will be inserting something onto the database with the help of the table name and the values that I'm passing here. So I'll just talk about what all values and how I'll be passing values here. So I go on to the main activity here. Into the main activity when I talk about, I have taken the references of these buttons and the edit boxes. And I have again, use the same insert dot, that is all the click listeners on the, onto the items and then I have placed methods beneath them. All right. So I'll just run this up once and then I'll be actually using it up in my application so that you can have some understanding as to what is being done here.